Okay, so when you're factoring a difference of squares, once in a while, you're going to look at the first two, the, the two terms. You're, you're going to recognize immediately those are not perfect squares. So what you're going to need to do first is, do these two things have something in common? And if they do, so if there are two terms and there's a subtract sign, it might be a hidden difference of squares. You have to factor like terms first, factor out what they have in common, and then go ahead and write the conjugates. All right, so what these two have in common, they're both even numbers, they both have a two in common. And then 50 divided by two is 25, times x squared. So 50x squared divided by 2 is 25x squared. Do not make this mistake by saying, oh, well, 2 and 2 cancel out to be 0. Do it this way. 2 divided by 2 is 1. And now look at what you have. 25x squared is a perfect squared. 1 is a perfect square. And then go ahead and factor. So remember, it's the square root of this that will go in the two sets of parentheses, and the square root of this will go into the two sets of parentheses. The square root of 25x squared is 5x. The square root of 1 is 1. And you put those in the two sets of parentheses, and there you have your factor. And do not forget to keep bringing the factored out two down uh, with, with factoring. All right, that's it.